welcome back before i get into my little share with you guys my project share i wanted to show you the collection that i that i was using that i have been using for a while it's the fairy tale club um the my magical world collection by andrea i don't want to butcher her name beth key beth key i don't know i i don't want to say it wrong but this is her hand drawn she's got a of course magical world she's got fairy tale vibes and almost like a you know a mouse vibe here these are some of the ephemera that she has such pretty pretty ephemera here anyway that's and then i've already gone and used some stickers she has some papers oh uh, well these acrylic pieces super pretty there's like an iridescent one and I haven't gotten around to using this crafty girl. I have another project coming up that I have that in mind for. Not only does she have beautiful papers, um, these are some of the ones that I've already used, but look at how pretty they are. And they're double sided. They're so pretty. And as you can see, I've already used a ton of it. They come in the 12 by 12 papers as well as these really pretty, <clears throat> excuse me, she has like a planner kind of insert already it's really pretty they're so cute and what drew my attention was this i make cute stuff very adorable okay so let's get into the project that i created this was not my idea okay this was christian's idea i will link her video on how to create this she did a wonderful job she does constant tutorials and she does such a beautiful job of explaining and putting it together and she shows you on her videos how to make it and on her lives she decorates it so if you don't follow her i suggest you do because it is a fun cha um, channel that she has so she recently created a boom box and the reason I thought this line was perfect because I think boom boxes and cassettes are kind of what was done at the, I wanna say the 90s. That was kind of the last generation before CDs came out. And so I'm part of that generation where I was still able to put a cassette in and record your favorite song. And if you know what I'm talking about, shout out to you because you still know what I'm talking about. Um, so I created this using her tutorial and like I said, beautifully done. And a lot of the pieces are from that collection. This is a boom box. It's super cute. Look at it. And I decided to do the, the speakers as um, shakers. I don't want to shake it too much just because of the stuff inside. But anyways, she did a beautiful job at the tutorial i added pieces that are sewn the flare buttons ephemera this acrylic piece that says magic and it gives it a subtle tone so you can't really see it in the beginning and then when you really look at it it's beautiful okay so let's go ahead and open it up of course it's a box and she did the tutorial with the cassettes that can fit perfectly inside of this box and it is so adorable perfect for um like crafty swaps where you can put different things in each of the cassettes and i thought i'd label the cassette with like songs that are super cute so here is making memories and then i'm assuming that these girls are from her design team because she has a little backstory on her one of her papers i noticed and she they're princesses and stuff and um, they were imaginative and creative and original and she here it is and these are her designers so it's like Andrea Christina and Taylor and Carol Tyla so I, I'm assuming those are her friends her designer crafty friends I don't know and then this one says I make my own magic this other one it says hey girl hey and I used a sequence for like the middle parts. Everything is sewn. I think that just makes it extra cute. And then this one is Crafty Princess. And she's got a bottle of glue. And some scissors. There you go. And like I said, it's perfect because each box 
can house different things. For example, charms, dangles, and it fits perfect. So you can gift your friends different things. This one is making memories. And I added this little lip right here, lift right here. And some ephemera, some tool, frosted tool um, that can be gifted in there. So you can see the your boombox can be anything theme. I mean, come on, a summer one. This is a princessy craft one. Can you imagine? It just it's endless. And then some ephemera from the collection that I thought was cute, and I you could see it fits in perfectly. And then last but not least, some little bows gifted to me and crocheted, so pretty. But I thought this was such a cute idea. When Christian made this, I was like, oh my gosh, these colors are so girly and amazing and the boom box, I have to create one because it reminds me of childhood. And if a cassette and a pencil don't bring back memories, Oh my gosh, I don't know what does. Anyways, so that is my share for today. And she, like I said, she did a amazing job at measuring and making sure that everything fit in together. It's so cute. I mean, come on, how can you not? And then mine's a little heavy, but I'm thinking you could put like a little strap in the back, maybe to be able to hold it really well. Of course, it's just for looks, but I thought it was adorable. And thank you guys for stopping by. Like I said, I will link Christian's channel in the description so you can go ahead, click it, follow it, and do her amazing tutorial because it's not hard. At least I didn't think it was hard. Lots of measuring, but it is worth it when it came to the assembling of or decorating part. I thought it was so fun. Look at that. How cute. And I've seen a couple of different people. Christina, who is um, KG Crafts, she did one. And Craft Perch Tony, she made one as well. And it's beautiful and fun to see all these different types of um, their their crafty style put into their boom box. It is so pretty. And I can't wait to gift this to somebody. So go check her out. Like I said, link's in the description. And thanks for stopping by, guys. Show you some stills. Bye.